So NXT happened. Oxyom and Nathan Fraser defeated the Good Brothers and Jordan Wild and whatever. Uh, uh, and Cor- the LWO people. They face Baron Corbin and Ron Breaker at NXT. Uh, by the way, yes, this is definitely later. This is definitely filmed after Stand and Deliver. Um, just, you know, I just didn't have the time to do a bunch of videos as I wanted to. But hey, we'll catch it. Catching up, you know, catching up. Lacey Jane defeats Fallon Henley. Hot four duo. That's all I have to say. This is going to lead to a six women tag match. That's Nan and Deliver. Lexus King defeats Von Wagner. Uh, whatever. And there's been good shit going on for that, but it's whatever. Um, Lola Vice defeats Carmen uh, Pentacro. Whatever. This is what Natty Nightfart is doing. Because no one cares. But she's done nothing. We have the Meta 4 Lounge or something, some gay shit or whatever. Live up here of Roxanne Perez come face to face before their women's title match and a brawl breaks out because with Lyra standing tall with this plastic table. I don't know, get it? It's, uh, it's very Im- intense or whatever. You know, nobody really cares. Oh, but Femi defeats Joe Gessie from Referee Suffrage. Ariana Grace defeats Ren Skitclair. Idja Dragunov and Tony D'Angelo have a meeting ahead of their NXT title match. Um, they respect each other or whatever. And, and um, I don't know, they had like dinner, I think, but it's like on a different location. And um, they're all about serious business. Sol Ruka defeats Blair Davenport. Oh, she looks hot right there. Uh, Ava, Ava uh, thinks that she created a great card, but then she books Joe Gacy versus John Spears because Joe Gacy wants John Spears. And the main event... Carmella is a trick William gets into a brawl and the locker room ref security come out and separate them, but then we have some brawl with some wrestlers. I don't know, like, I get it, like this is so intense. So Carmelo Hayes and Trick Williams get, have a like intense, I like, get it, you know. They have a word a word of, off, like, oh, you know, Carmelo Hayes, you know, you know, like, you know, like trick you a trick doesn't miss. You know, Carmelo, you know, yeah, I used you, man. You just knew all my lackey and shit, man. You never were, were big, you know. I was always bigger than you. I was bigger than you, man. That's why I made me take over the shit, man. And Trick Williams, you know, talking about it's going like, you know, she had always had his back and it was all because of it was a help of him why he succeeded where he is, all that kind of shit, and then eventually brawl. It's whatever, you know, it is what it is. Oh, yeah, they mentioned how, like, you know, this is Trick Williams' hometown that he's going to be an event in, and, you know, they're going to make a star and blah, blah, blah. You know, uh, it's whatever. It is what it is, folks. So that's that's NXT. It's nothing really that big or exciting to make, make, have a go-home show. You know, it's just like they had enough. They had a lot of timing. You know, that's why they needed to do whatever to try to build the show. It is whatever. So that's what, that's what they did for Stand Deliver. Not much excitement, but it's not terrible exactly. That's what I'm going to say. Until next time, peace. Yeah, bye.